Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is not clickbait. I am actually going to be telling you guys how I personally make money on YouTube, how you can make money on YouTube, and how to get monetized. The reason why I'm doing this is mainly because I get many questions about this literally every single day and at first I was unsure if I wanted to do this because I'm just gonna be honest I don't make a lot of money on YouTube at all and I know that some YouTubers make a video like this and then say like oh I don't make a lot of money on YouTube and then still make like hundreds of dollars but be aware I don't make a lot of money on YouTube and that is fine because I do this because I love it and people tend to think that I do make a lot of money but I don't so yeah and it also just felt a little bit weird to talk about how much money you're making I don't know that just feels a little bit weird but since literally every single person on this planet wanted to know this and also because people ask me this in real life which happens a lot and then I just answer so I thought why not just share it with the rest of you guys so obviously I only have about 3,000 subscribers which is already super crazy to me and I'm super thankful but I feel like there's a lot of mixed opinions about making money on YouTube and also a lot of wrong opinions so this video is basically just to clear things up I guess so let's just get right into it there are so many different factors that go into making money on YouTube and I will get more into those later but first I'll just give you a quick overview of how you get monetized because that is kind of the biggest part of actually making money on YouTube step to getting monetized is reaching the requirement so the requirements are to get 4,000 hours of watch time and basically watch time is the time that people actually spend watching your videos like for example if you make a 10 minute long video and someone watches the whole video throughout like the whole 10 minutes then you have 10 minutes of watch time but if you have someone that clicks off after four minutes of watching you only have four minutes of watch time if that makes sense so you need 4,000 hours which takes a while and you need to reach that in the previous 12 months so in one year you need to reach 4,000 hours then the next requirement is to have a thousand subscribers and the other requirement is to make videos that meet YouTube their policies but to be honest that isn't hard because the only like way that you don't meet their policies is if you like curse a lot or like murder people in your video or anything like really do something that is not allowed on youtube but i hope no one does that <laughs> so once you reach the requirements you need an adsense account and you can either do this before you reach the requirements or after that doesn't really matter i think but i did it before just to have an adsense account but like i said i don't think that really matters so then when you do reach the requirements and you have an adsense account youtube is gonna review your channel and see if if you get approved or declined basically the only reason why you would get declined is probably because you didn't meet their policies or if you make videos that are not like advertisement friendly or anything like that like YouTube just needs to verify your account if it's good for monetization but then if you are approved you need to verify your home address and your payment method and I think I do this to like um, make sure that you're like a real person I'm not sure if that's why they do this but I think so to verify your address they sent you a little note with a pin on it I think I might still have that. Wait, I found it. You get this in the mail. This has my address, so I'm not going to show you, but it just says Google AdSense. And then I don't know if I can show the pin code, but it has this and it says like what you need to do. And then here it says the pin. Um, yeah, and basically by doing that, you verify your address and that you're a real person. And then for your payment method, Google sent you like a couple of cents. I think for me, it was like four cents to your like preferred way of getting paid. And then you have to tell Google AdSense how much they sent you to verify that you're the person they sent it to. That was not a good way of explaining it, but I guess you get it. Honestly, when I reached the requirements of getting monetized, I watched a couple of those videos about it and a lot of people were saying that it would take ages to get approved and that everything was taking so long. But personally for me, that didn't take that long at all. And I don't know if I was just lucky, but I reached the requirements of getting monetized on May 5th. 2019 then I got the email saying that I was approved on May 9th so that only took four days and then I got this somewhere in June I don't know the exact date but it was in June so that honestly didn't take that long but it might take longer for you I don't know I don't know also something I quickly want to say about being monetized when you are monetized that doesn't necessarily mean that every single one of your videos is gonna make you money because that's a few things that can make your video like demonetized which is if the video has copyright in it or if the video is like not advertisement friendly because basically being monetized means that there's gonna be advertisements on your video so if you are like cursing a lot or if it's just not advertisement friendly then your video can be demonetized also I think your video can be demonetized if you talk about like certain topics 
but that also is maybe not advertisement friendly. I don't know, okay. So then, how to actually make money on YouTube? So there's a couple of different ways that can make you money on YouTube. First way is ad revenue, which is the way that I'm going to be talking about this throughout the rest of this video. This is basically when Google runs ads on your videos and you can make money by showing the ads basically. The next way is sponsorships. I have never had a sponsorship before, but basically how this works is basically a brand or company, they um, contact you and you promote their product or service or whatever the company is for and they send you money to do that. But there's also a lot of different type of sponsorships I feel like because you can either talk about a company for like one to three minutes in a video or you can make a whole video dedicated to it I don't know there's probably a lot of different things and I have no idea because I've never done a sponsorship but yeah there's probably videos on YouTube about it but I also think youtubers are not like legally allowed to say how much money they're making off sponsorship I also think people didn't know they were allowed to talk about how much money they were making off like ad revenue for the longest time but ever since last year people started making videos about that and now i'm doing it too so yeah and then lastly you also have partnerships which is basically when a company sends you um a product for free and then you promote the product it's kind of the same thing as a sponsorship but for a partnership you don't get paid so i'm going to be talking about making money through ad revenue and basically this is all like organized by google like companies go to google and they're like hey i want this ad to be played on videos like they pay google to play their advertisements. So there are many different factors that go into making money off ads. How many ads are in the videos, the topic of the video, the CPM, the location of the viewers, the watch time, the views, the age of the viewers, and a lot more. So there is a lot of different things. Also, you might not know what CPM is if you're not a YouTuber, but CPM means cost per mile, which is basically cost per thousand views. That doesn't mean that if your CPM is $10, you get $10 for a thousand views because there's also a difference between normal views and monetized views. Monetized views are basically views where people who watch it get an ad on your video. This is so complicated to explain, but I hope you understand the difference between a monetized view and a regular view because a regular view doesn't get an ad on your video, so you're not making any money of that. Also, something that YouTube does is they take 55% um, of your income. I don't know why they do that, but they do. How do you actually get paid? So YouTube pays out monthly and they pay on the 21st of the month. So basically, for example, for the month February, you make videos from the 1st of February to the 28th and then YouTube like calculates how much money you're making. And then I think between like the 11th and the 15th of March, like from the next month, your money goes from your YouTube studio to Google AdSense. And then on the 21st, Google AdSense actually deposits the money to you through your preferred bank method. Something else that YouTube does, I don't know if this is YouTube or Google that does this, but basically if you want to get paid, you have to reach a threshold every month. And I know that in like the US, this threshold is $100, but for me personally, on my Google AdSense, it says that this threshold is 70 euros. And I don't know why that is because 70 euros is not equal to $100, but I guess that is just the rule in the Netherlands that it's 70 euros, I don't know. So also disclaimer, when I will be talking about how much money I'm making, I'm going to be talking in euros because I'm from Europe and I earn euros. <laughs> So basically how this works, if you, for example, make 72 euros in January, you will get paid on the 21st of February. But if you make 69 euros, you will not get paid because you didn't reach the 70 euros. But that doesn't mean that that money is going to disappear. Like you still made that money, but it's just going to stay in your AdSense account until you do reach the threshold. Like the 69 euros is just going to stay in your account and then you make more money the next month. So then the next month when YouTube is going to pay out, they're just going to pay you for the two months together, like the 69 euros plus whatever you made in the next month. I really don't know why they do that, but that is just something that is like a rule. So yeah, if you are wondering if I reached this threshold, I reached this once in November. I only got one paycheck from YouTube so far, so yeah, just so you know. So now I will be talking about how much money I'm making on YouTube right now. So 
like I said, I only got paid once so far in November and I'm gonna get my analytics with me. So if I look at my revenue from the very first start that I got monetized, um, the total revenue of my channel is 105 euros and 83 cents. My best earned video is my video where I went to Australia, which made me nine euros and 21 cents. So monthly, it really depends on how many videos you're making, how many views you get. Like I said, it depends on a lot of things. So every month is just really different. And honestly, you never really know what to expect because I didn't think my Sydney video was gonna make me like that much money, but it did, so. Another little disclaimer before I go into like my monthly revenue, a lot of my videos are copyrighted because before I got monetized, I didn't care if I used songs that were copyrighted because I wasn't making money off them anyway and now I still make a lot of playlist videos which are obviously copyrighted so I can't make any money off those videos and also sometimes when I like just want to play a song in a video like in like a vlog or something I just do play the song because that's just who I am I guess I just want my videos to be genuine and I don't want money to come in between of that I don't know if this sounds logical but I hope you get my point so a lot of my videos are copyrighted, which means I don't make any money, just so you know. So, monthly. Um, I got monetized in May 2019, as I said. So in that month, I posted nine videos and I made nine euros and 11 cents. But I don't really know if that's from the whole month or something because I got monetized like halfway through, so... I don't know how that works. In June, I posted eight videos, but three of them were copyrighted, so basically five videos, and I made 13 euros and 14 cents. In July, seven videos, two copyrighted, so five videos again, and I made 16 euros and five cents. August, five videos, one copyrighted, so four, and I made 13 euros and eight cents. September, five videos again, six euros and 50 cents. September is the month where I made like the least of my money. October, six videos, 10 euros and 94 cents. And then November, this is the month where I made most of my money because this is also the month where I posted my Sydney video. But it's really funny because I only posted three videos and one of them was copyrighted. So only two monetized videos and I made 16 euros and 32 cents which is kind of weird when you think about it because it's only two videos but it makes a lot more money than when i post eight videos <laughs> what and then december i posted 10 videos but six of them were copyrighted <laughs> so four monetized videos um and i made 10 euros and 83 cents so that was 2019 and for january so far i made four videos from which one was copyrighted and so far i made around six euros so like i said i got paid by google once which was in november and this payment was a payment of 72 euros and 46 cents and now i'm just like on my way to reach this threshold again so every month i make a bit of money and it goes into my google adsense until i reach the 70 euros again and currently from november and december i'm on 27 euros and 11 cents and then plus what i made in january but that's not in my adsense account yet but it's probably gonna be between 30 and 40 euros so i'm like halfway on the threshold that is how much money i'm making i don't know if this was interesting for anyone but i just thought i would clear things up because like i said i feel like there's a lot of wrong and mixed opinions about this because a lot of people think that if you make one video you are instantly making like 300 euros on one video and i don't even know why i'm making this video but since i get so many questions about it i just thought I'd share it because honestly I don't care. I do want to say that I'm incredibly grateful that I can even get paid by doing something that I love because I have been making videos on the channel for the past four years and like my passion for it hasn't even faded away a little bit so it's just really cool that I can get like something in return for the love and effort I put into this and it's just nice that I can kind of turn in my hobby into my job even though it's not an actual job because I don't get paid that much. I'm really thankful for the fact that I can even do this so go watch my advertisements from now on guys <laughs> just kidding well i'm not really kidding if this is the first video you're watching of me i immediately want to make videos on this channel every week go subscribe to my channel if you want give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and i will see you next time bye bye